In this demonstration, I'll show how to use virtual topology to deal with imperfections in the model, then mesh the model using multi-zone methods. In the previous video in this series, I sliced the blade model into six bodies, but I identified imperfections that could be more efficiently dealt with using virtual topology. I first need to determine which bodies are sweepable. If a body is sweepable, I should be able to get a good quality hex mesh on it. The hub and one of the intersection regions are sweepable, so I don't need to clean them up. However, the rest of the bodies are not sweepable, so I need to use virtual topologies to clean up any imperfections. The second intersection region below the blade tip is not sweepable. I'll look at it more closely to find the imperfections. I'll hide all other bodies to get a closer look. This body is not sweepable because one side has two faces, while the other side has only one. To fix this issue, I'll merge the two faces by inserting a virtual cell. The faces are now merged, but there are still a couple of extra vertices that will prevent the body from being sweepable. I can't merge these edges because they're connected to the plate body. I'll merge the faces that are connected to these edges. And now I can merge the edge splits to get rid of the extra vertices. Now I can show all sweepable bodies to verify that this body is sweepable. This concludes part two of this video series. In part three, I'll clean up the intersection region between the hub and plate and address the fillets.